I will describe like it's always trying to to move fast the ball, you know, to don't uh, have the ball that much on my feet. Just one, two touches. You get also the other team running around, and it's it can make a dangerous uh, action. Victor's our playmaker. One of the things that make him so successful is because he's an extremely intelligent person, but, but most importantly, a decision maker on the field. Comes from uh, one of, if not the uh, richest traditions in Barcelona. When I started to play in Barcelona, for me it was already a dream because I was growing up in a really small village, you know? And then when I got there, it was for me like, wow, I'm here, you know, I'm, I'm wearing that shirt with this stamp here that it's, wow, it's really big for me. Yeah, I have a tattoo here that it says, only the strongest survive. Because when I got injured on my knee, it was a really hard period for me. It was like 14 months out from the soccer. I was really sad and upset and I say, okay, my time is over. Now I feel my knee like it's not gonna work the same, you know? The coaches that make a lot, really impact on me, it was Guardiola and Luis Enrique. They came to me and they say, okay, Victor, don't worry. You're gonna be a great player for sure. You're gonna recover, you're gonna work hard and you're gonna come back. I really appreciate that Guardiola and Luis Enrique were all the time behind me. You have to take always the good things and when you have the bad things, you know? Now I have to start to think outside from Barcelona. We, we quickly escalated those, uh, our attempts to, to acquire him because we felt like he could be the missing piece on the roster. And when Toronto came, I, I say to my wife, I think it's the time to go. He does so. It's out of all. It's Vasquez! And Victor Vasquez scored his first goal for Toronto FC. I have better feeling when I'm playing more forwards because it's my way to play offense. And with Josie and Seba, I think it's where I feel much better when I'm close to them. And we are really connecting really fast and also because they have amazing quality too. You know, Seattle, given the way that they played and they sat back on us, uh, really, for 90 minutes, one of the holes was a sort of attacking midfielder piece. When I came here, I, I watched this final, and I'm trying to don't think too much on this because it's a final, you lose in penalties. I think this is more lucky than, than soccer way, you know? And we are trying to, to win finally the MLS Cup because it's going to be really important for a Canadian team and, of course, for our club. I think in, in our team we are pretty confident and we know that we are the best ones on MLS and we can do it. Why not?